brought their own people over to Ireland, over to this northeast end of Ireland, and Scottish as well. They were called planters. It was the period of the plantation where they put Irish Catholics off their lands and replaced them with English and Scottish. So this is why we have the Ulster Scots connection with Scotland. Uh, through all the years of English rule here, in 1916, which we're celebrating today, the Easter Rising in Dublin in 1916. When the Irish IRA established a provisional government and they fought the British Army on the 26th, 24th of April till the 29th of April in Dublin. The British Army racked Dublin with their heavy artillery. The IRA had machine guns and rifles and that was it. But that was a statement they made. Now, so from then and later on, now we have a civil war after that. I'm not going to be here all day telling you about that. But in 1921, this little statement was formed. Now, the British give the Ulster Protestants six counties of Ulster. And we were left, the Catholics were left with them. The Irish government abandoned us up here. Uh, so from 1921 to 1968 we were treated like second class citizens through all those years. And I'll tell you the bits and bobs on the way around. So this is where we are today from the 1998 Good Friday Agreement when all the political parties all signed up to this supposed peace. So we'll get on with us there. Okay. Okay. Thank you. The other side of the street. Right, behind that hoarding, uh, that wall, and it spilled out onto this road. So the, now, the police came around this corner here in a tank. Now, could you believe a police force had a tank? They called them Shoreland tanks. It was a little mini tank with a 30 millimeter machine gun mounted on top. Now, it had, didn't have tracks, it had four tires. So it came around here and opened fire, 30 millimeter machine gun. And this is where they killed the soldier who was riding here out right with the rest of the Catholics that were riding. And the rest of that complex was five story high. And there was thousands of people lived in those flats. I mean, they built a slum, a brand new slum. You couldn't put wallpaper on your, on your walls at night time because in the morning it would be lying on the floor with the dampness. And if we, if we don't forget, I'll show you around the corner so led up to the uh, hunger strikes which yeah. eventually 10 men died that's okay come on love come on you'll be all right <laughs> oh, yeah. so i had like oh, like that watch i feel like a bad mother and i come <laughs> she's sick yeah Okay. That's great. <laughs> Look in the gun. You know, these are, these are brand new houses here. Now, if you want that house there, and you get up, open your curtains every morning, and there's the gunman. He give you an alarm clock. 
Yeah, just been built. And the, 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 the,